Uh, I was thinking about the question of specific experiences that were exceptional last summer, and I, it does relate to bridging because we're looking for very exceptional people who really do care and will do what needs to be done. Uh, people ask me, what is the job description? And I say, we do what needs to be done. And that means that we have to communicate well because people might push themselves a little too far. Um, but I do have very high expectations. I care very deeply. And one thing that was so amazing this last summer was to see an idea in my mind, really, about what TSI is. Uh, to see that so fully adopted and embodied by the interns and the teachers we had last summer. I saw them passionately defending the values of TSI and what TSI means. Very much it means respecting people of different cultures and really being humble as an international guest and really working hard, really working hard to provide something of value for Bosnians. I remember one time I was going into a conversation with two of the interns and they were not happy with me. And I didn't know what the conversation was going to be about. I went into it, we were halfway through the internship. They had honestly worked a full internship in those four weeks. They had worked incredibly hard. And I went into that meeting fully prepared to say that if you have had enough, it's okay. I will write you glowing recommendations for the rest of your career and I am truly eternally grateful for everything you've done. I didn't know what the problem was and really it was just that they were working so hard and had such high expectations and um, the and part of it was my management style that needed some help. But the thing I really remember from that, one of the things I remember, is being told, Chris, you cannot have it both ways. If you want us to do our best, then we might not sleep, but that's up to us. So don't tell us when we should go to sleep. Don't tell us that we should get more sleep. If I don't have to sleep, if I don't sleep for the next month, that's my business. I will do my best. And that's really what I was told. And when they told me everything they had to say, I had to go to the bathroom after a while. I was going to the bathroom and I turned to them and I said, I hate to be so optimistic, but all I see here is love. And what I saw was people who really, really, really cared. And I saw that in each and every intern we had. And I, that, seeing that in the interns was really incredible. And it's growing. So now we have ambassadors for TSI. And every year you never know if it's really gonna happen. And I honestly, it feels like a miracle. And it's, it's really based on faith that if you create the circumstances and you are discerning, you are careful about who you choose, that the best in humanity will come forward. And it, 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 has, it has happened for two summers now. And our, you know, our hope and our intention is to create it every summer. But it, it is really an expression of pure idealism and dedication. Um, as far as a, a specific example, I remember with one of the students uh, in 2009, we had a student who wanted to talk to me in private, and I was a little uncomfortable. I didn't know why, and it was just me. And I finally said, well, please let me bring some colleagues who I trust. And it turned out that this student had lost many of her family members. She was from a, a disadvantaged family, and she was ashamed because she just wanted to go to college, and she didn't she was too shy to say it. So she just said, I, I, I want to go to college. And I had spent two or three days wondering, what is it? And we helped her. We, um, we helped her just build her confidence to say it. Say it. I want to go to college. Talk to your professors. Talk to the director. It's okay. Of course it's okay. You deserve an education. And this summer she came up to me and she said, uh, I've been, I've, gotten, I've been accepted into a university. I'm going to the economics faculty in Sarajevo, and I did what you said. I believed in my dreams, and I pursued it. And you have a moment like that, and it really makes it feel like everything you're doing is worth it.